Okay, so this is how I do the magic circle. I feel it's super easy. It's never failed me. This right here is our working yarn from the skein. So I'm going to wrap that around my hand. And then this here is a tail yarn, tail end. So I'm just going to take that tail and all I do is put it behind the working yarn like that. And then I just pinch it with my fingers here. Pull this down a little bit and that is my magic circle. So you'll notice if I zoom in, it's just right there behind my working yarn and I just pinch it. And then I take my hook, I insert my hook in that magic circle, yarn over, bring that through. Then I chain one and then I work whatever stitches I need to in the center of this circle. So I'm going to go ahead and just do um, 10 half double crochets. So one, two, three. Okay, so I have 10 half double crochets in the center there. And what I like to do before I close my circle is I like to join with a slip stitch to the first stitch. And the reason I like to do that, especially if you're new, sometimes this here first stitch will get lost in this vertical bar when you pull your magic circle tight. And then that can, um, you know, disrupt your stitch count and sometimes it's hard to see that first stitch. So I always like to just join with a slip stitch and then I close my magic circle. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And then after I join, I just pull up some extra yarn. I just put my hands here in the center and I'm going to grab my tail and just pull on that tail nice and tight. And there we go. My magic circle is nice and closed. Hope that helps. Thanks for watching.